Okay, so here's a level five Barvember problem. Tommy has 657 marbles. Dora has 365 marbles. They each give the same number of marbles to Whitney. Tommy now has three times as many marbles as Dora. And we're asked how many marbles did they each give to Whitney? I think it's actually quite a, a simple problem for a level five. Um, sometimes I find the level four ones are um, trickier to think about or explain. Anyway, let's let's um, let's draw this out. So we've got Tommy and we've got Dora. OK, now I know we mentioned Whitney, but I'm going to be I'm drawing a comparison model where I'm comparing um, I'm comparing one bar to another bar. I'm comparing, I'm going to be comparing Tommy to Dora. Now, they give marbles away to Whitney, but we're not told anything about um, how many marbles Whitney then has and how that might compare to Tommy and Dora. So she is um, sadly irrelevant to the model. Okay, so we've got Tommy and Dora. And... Where I'm actually going to start is here because it says Tommy now has three times as many marbles as Dora. So I am going to draw, that's going to be my basic block. Okay, in fact, Dora's got the basic block and Tommy has three times as many. So one, two and three. Okay, so that represents what we see here. What else are we told? We Well, we are told that they each gave away the same number of marbles to Whitney. OK, so um, I actually I I'm not sure there's much point drawing this bit in. I'll, I'll, I'll tell you why in a moment. What's the other bit of information we have? Well, we have this part here. This is where we have actually got some numbers. And that Tommy has 657 and Dora has 365. So we want to know the difference because we are comparing Tommy with Dora. So we need to know the difference. So 657 and 365. And that gives us a difference of 292. Now, OK, now. So this, let's see, that this is the difference. It's always good to label when you've got a multi multi step problems. It's always good to label what's going on, isn't it? OK, so. We could. Draw in. This blo a block now, this block, I'm deliberately making a different size from the others, but these these two blocks are meant to be the same. OK, and we now know the difference. OK, between these is 292. So this is Tommy's, all Tommy's marbles, as it were. Ha ha. Or he gave some away. So six, five, seven. And this is three, six, five. OK. Now, what you might notice is that if we take the same amount away, OK, from Tommy as from Dora, the difference between them will remain the same. OK. And in fact, we could re re redraw this. In fact, when I first did it, just penciled it out, I didn't even bother drawing this part. So. Let's go again. All right, so this is what we have for Tommy. This is what we have for Dora and the difference because it remains the same is 292. So perhaps here it might be just easier to see, except that I haven't used my lovely colours, OK? So that the difference is these two equal parts. So we need to have 292. We need to divide that 
by 2, which gives us 146. Okay, so each of these parts has a value of 146. 140. Okay, I don't have to draw this all in. It's just to show. And again, it's the same up here. Remember, this is just the same model I have dispensed with these um, equal parts that were given away to Whitney. And so what are we asked? We're asked how many marbles did they each give to Whitney? Well, it doesn't matter. We just need to um, subtract. Um, we now know what, what they had. Okay, we now know the value of these. All right, so 146, 146. Um, what we need to do is, well, let's look at what Dora has. So Dora had um, 365, okay? We know that this is 146. So here is our question mark. And clearly, we need to take 146 away from 365. So 365, 146, that gives us 219, okay? And that is our answer, 219 is what each of them gave to Whitney. Okay, so this is 219, as is this. Okay, hope that helps.